we're gonna get started with this blending color from NYX and we're gonna put that all over basically all over the eye this is gonna help us blend out our colors easily and it's gonna give a nice transition from our crease colors up to our brow bone highlight color and isn't that brush so pretty I love that brush like that brush that had my name written all over it thanks Sonia Kasha so next we're gonna go in with this eyeshadow from Ulta and we're going to put that just above the crease and in the crease you know how we do and remember people blend 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 and this color you can build it up to the intensity that you want but I'm not gonna make it too intense because I am going to put a deeper darker color directly in the crease and in the outer V so using our bedellium tools brush and this gorgeous plum color from Sephora we're gonna put that directly into our crease we're not gonna take it all the way over but we're definitely gonna focus it on the outer V corner outer V corner really on the outer V and slightly into the crease and then we're going to blend it nicely into the color we just placed on there and correction it's not bedellium it's delium tools okay and I love their brushes. I love their brushes. Don't forget to blend, blend, blend. Blend for your life. <laughs> no, seriously, blending can take your look from okay to ooh. Ooh, and this is my favorite highlight color from Glamour Doll Eyes. It's called Bare Naked. And putting that just under the brow, it gives just the right amount of shimmer and color. It's just so gorgeous. It's even really nice to wear by itself on the lid with a black liner. Mm. And the star of our show, Endless Sea. And we're going to put that bad boy all over the lid. And we're going to pack this on and build the color up. So pack it on, pack it on, pack it on. You can't put on enough of this color. Out of all the infallibles from L'Oreal, I have to say this is by far my favorite one. Um, it's just a gorgeous, gorgeous color and so versatile. You can wear it by itself. You can do it with a nice brown, but I'm going to shut up and let y'all watch what I do. Do, 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 do. But of course, adding color, you tend to lose color. So I'm just going to go back in with that deep, dark plum from Sephora. And I'm going to add that just on the outer portion where we placed it before. And then, of course, I'm going to blend that out. Because you do tend to lose some color sometimes when you're adding color. Does that make sense? Lose color when you add color. <laughs> but anywho... We're gonna take our highlight color from Glamour Doll Eyes and we're gonna put that into our inner corner to really make the eyes pop and brighten them up just a tad bit more and then just a little bit in our lower lash line, just in the inner portion. Then we're gonna line our waterline and our lower lash line with a black liner. This is from Smashbox. I also like the one from Makeup Forever. They're just so creamy and spreadable. And then we're also going to take that just under our lower lash line as well. I hate fallout. I really hate fallout. Now we're not going to put too much because we are going to smudge this out with another color. But just enough. And now we're gonna take this gorgeous color from MAC. Isn't that pretty? It's going to smudge that out on top of the black and just get those two together nicely. Oh, my nose is stuffy. Who we'll gets sick in July? I do. I get sick in July. 
Now off camera, I'm gonna line my eyes with my Ruby Kisses liner because I don't want you guys to watch me poke myself in the eye. And then I am going to add my mascara. And this is such a nice one. I'm really, really enjoying this from Rimmel or Rimmel, whatever it's called. But I'm really, really enjoying this mascara. I like it. I think it's a keeper. And I'm just gonna coat the lashes, coat it as much as you want. You can totally put on falsies if you like. I'm not going to because I'm going to go and wash my face off right now. And once you've done that, that is basically your eye. Hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching. This is a look that I've rocked for a couple of days now. And I'm really, really enjoying it. So I wanted to share with you guys. Bye-bye.